it's Matthew Oliver from Ultimate Road Trips and I'm with my mate Damien Abraham in his 991 Turbo S. Hello. Dame, yep. um, what's the box exhaust you got on it? It's got like a Presto Valtronic exhaust. Nice. So yeah, various sport modes. Not all you can have it open all the time, which is very loud, right. which we can demonstrate later, but you yep. won't hear it very well inside. Yeah. And uh, why did you feel that like you needed to do that to the turbo? Well, that's one of the lacking points of the Turbo S. It just doesn't have the oral pleasure that you would expect from such a car. <laughs> well, we, and we all like a little bit of oral, don't we? We love oral. So, we certainly uh, do. And this gives you a lot of oral pleasure when you need it. And you can have it quiet if you, if you don't want, if you don't want to wake the neighbours up in the morning. So yeah, so we're, we're off to... Um, sad day today, sad day. Well, sad. Sad, with a silver lining. We're off to GVE today. Um, it's a dealer that... Uh, Actually, none of the Ultimate Road Trips crew have uh, had the pleasure of dealing with yet, but uh, Dame has brought... Dame, what have you brought? Um, I bought a 2016 McLaren 650S Spider. Oh, nice. I hope so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, well, you're going to see more pictures of that later, but um, I guess we need to ask, why? Uh, well, I've had this car for 18 months. I bought it, from, I bought it new. I've loved it, but I've only travelled 6,000 miles in it. Um, I think I've done the Porsche thing for now. I probably may come back to Porsche Turbo S again, because the new Mark II Turbo S is supposed to be pretty un unbelievable. But I just really fancied that supercar feeling. Although the Porsche is a supercar, it's more of a, a GT car, I think. Um, you know, you, you can fit the kids in the back, which I do on regular occasions. I take the three kids out and they love it. But I think the McLaren is something special for me. I don't know, I just, I'm just looking forward to something new. And I like changing my cars, just like Matthew does. Not quite as, not quite as frequently, but I'm getting there. <laughs> well, they do say variety is the spice of life. Um, and so you, uh, so what, what made you think about, I mean, could you not have brought the Mac in addition to the, the Turbo X and got rid of the M3? You can use this as your more of your daily. Not really, not really. I'll, I want to keep oh, the McLaren special for weekends and I want to keep my daily car, seeing customers, picking kids up. I've got four children, so I need baby seats. I can't get baby seats in the Porsche, so the M3 as a daily car is pretty pretty good, pretty good for me. Yeah, yeah we all need, we need one of those. And then your uh, your other half, she drives the BMW X5? She's got the X5 seven-seater, so that's the kiddie carrier. But on the odd occasions when I do need to pick up all four children, then the M3 does serve its purpose. I don't want them all on the Porsche with crisp packets, chocolate fingers and potential sick. So. <laughs> and anyone with kids will totally know what we mean by hands on windows, dirty feet marks on the back of seats. Yeah. Um, so uh, so those that don't have kids, don't let that put you off because they are really lovely. Okay, some tunnel time in the 991 Turbo S. Uh, the Ultima back with us and uh, Dame's uh, soon not to be his 991 Turbo S uh, so I thought we'd probably just have a quick uh, quick look around it actually just before it goes it's been wrapped almost a bit like sort of like the tech art Turbo S you gonna be sad to see it go Dame? yeah very sad yeah emotional last drive okay Hopefully here we there. are inside uh, GVE. This is uh, not been here before, as I said earlier. But yeah. Enough said. Have a look at this. Porn. Everywhere. SVs. Ferraris. McLarens. Maseratis.
Ah. Cheers. Yeah, cheers, Damo. Cheers. Oh. What a colour. Look at that. What a colour. Fully detailed. Full protection wrap. Are you literally leaking right now, Dame? Yeah, I'm moist. Look at that. Congratulations, buddy. Thank you, mate. If this thing isn't on the route Napoleon, yeah, I'm going to personally Kill destroy me. you. Here it is. McLaren 650S Spider. Looking so good in that paint. I don't know if you can see. Like them. That was sparkling off the paintwork. Beautiful paint. Old and new. Two turbos. GT4 RS. 675LT Coupe. 675LT Spider. CLK 63AMG Black Series. SVR Range Rover. G Wagon, SLS Roadster, SLS Roadster, 997 Gen 1 GT3, GT4, Alpha 4C, stunning 599 GTA, Rolls, V10 Plus, that isn't a GT. Lovely 911, I think it's an RS, isn't it? Yeah, 993 RS. Ferrari corner. F12, 599, 599, 599. 430, California, 599. And of course, Maserati, a little bit like Phil, part of our Ultimate Road Trips crew, except his is the, has the, is the MC Shift. Right, so, first start up at Amaka. I think it's about to go topless. It really is, it's a brand new car, but Beautifully, beautifully done, great spec, carbon blades, lovely, a lovely sparkle fleck in the blue, I'm sure there's a McLaren name for it. Such a poser, Dane. <laughs> stitching. It's all about that little plaque just there. Okay so I think that's all done here. Big thanks to uh, Guy at GVE for uh, a great handover and they've got some incredible cars here. Um, Dame is uh, just in the process of um, getting in his 650S and ready to take it out. Looks so good without that front number plate. Just the way every supercar should be. Thank you very Have much. Have a safe journey back. Cheers, take care mate. Cheers, bye How's bye. How's it feel Dave? It feels brilliant mate. You're going to 
Okay, Dame's first drive in the 650S. It's a beautiful day, so hot, like 28, 29 degrees. The Ultima was, um, yeah, the Ultima was, was very, very warm, <laughs> to say the least. And Dame, I think, was enjoying a bit of sunbathing whilst he was driving along the M25 and M11. But uh, take a look at the cars, here we are. I'm gonna find out, we're gonna do a little conversation in a minute, find out, Dame, what you thought of his, uh, what he thought of the first drive, but, um, yeah, great fun. So much attention, both of them. They just, uh, every car is uh, waving and thumbs up. So uh, it's, uh, it's been a great little ride. Right then, Damo, 650S Spider Collection, 80, 90 miles, six, 26, 27 degrees, didn't, blue skies, how break, was it? Didn't break the speed limit once. <laughs> it's an incredible car, not quite as responsive as the Porsche, but once you get going in the right gear, it's nothing like it through the tunnels, what an experience. I just can't wait to do a road trip. I expect to see a, uh, a blue 650S somewhere on the route Napoleon. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Cheers.